No. Nah, this gun's cracked. YouTube is today's video. I'm gonna be showing you guys the best two mirror class setup in Modern Warfare 2. There's so many different ways to build this gun. I built it in this video for recoil control, and this thing is an absolute laser beam. You guys have to give this class setup a try. I will be leaving the class setup at the end of the video, so make sure you guys do stay tuned for the class setup, the tunes, and everything like that, so you could copy it and go and slay your lobbies with it. Also, I am on the road to a thousand subscribers, so make sure you guys do consider hitting that subscribe button if you guys want to help me reach my goal. That would be much appreciated, and it would mean the world to me. Anyways, enjoy these MGB new gameplays. Yo, this thing, I can already tell this thing has no kick. Oh yeah, I could, I could already tell. I could already tell this is such a disgusting build. Yeah, this thing's a laser, dude. We're taking like an effective fire. Changing back. All objectives secure. Expect to come. Enemy securing Bravo. Enemy securing Bravo. Enemy securing Bravo. No way, I did not mean to pick that up. This thing is such a laser though. Reload AFK. Oh, what a spawn trap. Let's go. Oh my God. No, this thing is a laser. Oh shit. Yo, that's all right. I'm gonna go ahead and call it in. Just in case I forget, I forget way too much, way too much. Oh, there we go. Another new. This Chimera class is so good. It, the, the aimed on sight speed is a little bit slow, but like the recoil is almost non existent. So good. Locating the next hard point. Get ready. Taking effective. Ready for Oh, I would not mind if I do. Appreciate the spawn. A little spawn. Oh my god. No. Nah, this gun's cracked. Alright, is this guy just sitting here, bro?
Please run. What are you doing? Okay, what? There we go. There we go, baby. You guys have no... Okay. As soon as I get the nuke, I always die. It's just inevitable. It's like, I don't know how it happens. You go on a 30 kill streak and then out of nowhere, it's just like, nope. Well, I can tell you guys right now that this thing wow. is absolutely a beam. It is probably my favorite AR. It's probably my favorite AR. Has to be my favorite. Let's die it again, dude. Thank you, AFK. Oh my god, let me call it in. Let me- I'm spamming it. Done. Oh my god. I almost actually messed up, not gonna cap. Not gonna- okay. Called in my UAV instead of the nuke. I don't know how that happens. There we go, 52 kills and a nuke. Actually, not a bad game. Could have been better. I wish my teammates would have got off the, the point or whatever, but whatever. Could have had a longer game, but uh, try this class setup, you guys. I'm telling you guys right now, it is a absolute beam. The aim down sight speed is not that fast, obviously, because I really tuned it for recoil control and um stuff like that. Just just to give it a different build. Um, The Chimera, you can build it so many different ways. Um, Please give this class setup a try and tell me what you guys think. Anyway, here is the class setup. All right, so here's the attachments I was running on this class setup in today's video. For the first attachment, we got the Bruin flash grip rear grip tuning this to plus 0 0.90 for the recoil steadiness and negative 0 0.26 for the sprint to fire speed next i got the slime line pro super good optic to put on this gun uh, i think it's super clean uh, for this i tuned it to negative 2.61 for the aim down sight speed and i did not touch the eye position next for the barrel we got the 10 inch sa phoenix barrel tuning this to plus 0 0.50 for the recoil steadiness and negative 0 0.40 for the aim down sight speed for the under barrel i went with the commando foregrip under barrel tuning this to plus 0 0.54 for the recoil stabilization and negative 0 0.25 for the aim walking speed and last but not least the 45 round mag i feel like this is necessary it's super essential you guys should definitely be running a 45 round mag on your chimera class no matter what you guys have on this thing but that's just because i feel like 30 rounds is just not enough especially in the ar you're gonna want a lot of bullets to work with so 45 round clip is what i chose anyways i appreciate you guys for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next one peace